to know because all of us are on a journey to become our best selves. We're not always there yet. Actually, most of us aren't there yet. Most of us, even if we feel like we're our best selves, there's another level. We can become even better. So I was thinking about this uh, this this week because um, I, I happened to be at a religious service and uh, the the first name that is used for God in the Old Testament was brought up. And this name basically means I will be what I will be or I am becoming what I will be. And that's what we're all doing. We're all becoming who we can be. We are uh, in that process. And the idea that, you know, there's this name of God, I will be what I will be, or I am becoming. I am what I am. <laughs> this uh, really made me start thinking about this process of becoming our best self. Because in every moment you can choose who you want to be, who you want to become. We can take actions that put us on the path of becoming the person we want to become. So I want to inspire you today on Monday to do that, to get on the path of becoming your best self. So how do you do that? First, you have to make decisions about who you want to be. Who do you want to become? Make that decision. Then, number two, determine what it's going to take to get to that point, to be that person that you want to be. So if you want to be more loving, how can you be more loving? Can you be more demonstrative? Can you send cards? Can you tell people how you feel about them? What are you going to do to be more loving? So that's number two. So number one was decide who you want to be. Number two, determine what you have to do to get there. And number three is to fake it till you make it. Just start being that person. It's amazing how when we just begin to act as if we are that person, we become that person. Very simple. So there's no reason to sit around dreaming about the person you want to be or wishing you could be that person or uh, saying, I wish I could change so that I could be that person or these circumstances have to change for me to be that person. No need to do that. Just be that person. Decide today to be that person. Now, something else you can do as you're working on becoming who you're going to become is to journal. Journaling can be really important in this. To every day be asking yourself, um, you know, like in the evening to journal and say, you know, was I that person today? Or how could I do a better job of being the person I want to be? You know, how could I have done a better job in the last 24 hours of being that person and becoming that person? In the morning, you can also journal and, and write down the ways in which you will be that person. How are you going to act as if all day that you are your best self already? So these are some easy tips, really, to put into place. Now, change is never easy, really. So I said it was easy tips, but change takes work. But if you really want to be this person, if you want to be the best version of yourself that you can be, it's really important to start doing that now. Don't wait. You never know what's going to happen tomorrow. So don't wait. Go ahead and start being your best self now. Become you, the you you want to be. I'm Nina Amir. I'm the Inspiration to Creation Coach. I am a certified high performance coach and I would love to help you become your best self. If you're interested in that, please go to ninaamir.com forward slash free session. And there you can download an application for a free certified high performance strategy session. And let's see if we would be a good fit to work together and if I can help you achieve your goal of becoming your best self, of achieving your potential. And until then, go out there and achieve more inspired results.